I'm Neil Albertson uh, from Fremont, Iowa, uh, corn soybean farmer. Uh, livestock, all we have is hogs. That's probably what we're known for, purebred hogs. It, it is a seed stock operation, uh, but all of them are raised outside, open front type buildings for the most part, except for the farrying houses. Uh, primarily one reason we do that because we're into niche, selling the niche markets which are outside hogs. We're selling boars and gilts to just regular farmers, like I say niche guys, show pigs to kids for county fair and FFA project for state fair. I grew up starting in 4-H and uh, as I told you earlier, my first year I had a champion bear at the county fair, never did that again, but uh, really loved the fair as a kid myself and then as the kids grew up, uh, both of those wanted to be in 4-H as kids and so um, all they ever showed uh, was pigs, I guess, because that's what we had here. And that kind of evolved into uh, selling some show pigs and working with other families as well as our own. Um, then as we, they got a little older and we got into FFA at the state fair level, then that kind of expanded into some kids going to that uh, avenue too. So. Yeah, we worked with a lot of families. Uh, it's just kind of rewarding to see those kids go have some fun mainly, and if they do good, that's fine. We don't care if they win or lose, but as long as they learn a little bit and, and have some fun with them and their family, it's it's a good thing to be involved in is, are those 4-H and FFA programs. It doesn't have to be pigs, just any of them. A good farm neighbor, I guess, just don't be everybody's friend, number one. Uh, get along with your neighbors. I don't have a problem with not getting along, but be respectful of their property. If they need help, whether it be just they come and ask you or if there's a disaster, their family needs your help, you gotta be there. Uh, your neighborhood is, is bigger than just across the road. <laughs>